Hey, 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 my name is Polish Links and this is Presence Watts. Another late night recording. So, no loud reactions, that's for sure. ガードナーは消滅しました。今のところ再生する様子もありません。涼しいよ。大丈夫か。と、当然です。そんな姿のあなたに心配されるような怪我ではありません。そうか。よかった。よくなどありません。<笑> なぜそこまでして私を助けたりするのですか私はワルツを戦う敵放っておけばそれが一人下手というのに鈴城はそれでいいのか俺はそんな決着は望まない僕は戦わなくてはいけない君のぶつける思いと力を<笑> <俺は、笑> すべて受け止めてお前のクリス様への思いこんな形で終わらせたりするもんか私も望みませんこんな決着などだったらこのようなところで倒れることなど絶対に許しませんイリス<笑> 余計なこと心配するなよ必ず立ち上がれ気を失ったかわかりません すさまじい技だまさかこれほどの力を持っていようとはなおかげで命拾いしましたねあなたの愚かな小細工の尻拭いをしてもらったのですいくら感謝しても好きれないでしょう手厳しいなだが失敗と言い切ったものでもない結果
shy and so on, but you know, bored with everything, nothing else. <laughs> Didn't see that coming, huh? いや、僕らは<笑> イゼル姫は決闘以外の手段で私とイーリス姫に戦闘を仕掛けました。この行為に対する罰則の適用を望みます。それはできないよ。え。なぜですか？プリンセスワルツ検証には最低者の立ち会いの下で決闘を行うという
そのバカの一年とやら。Foolishness is power, sometimes. ズリ、記録。決闘開始。22時41分。Sorry, Crow, but it's actually eight, eight, nine minutes past two a.m. 戒律庭園の門を開きます。ではお二方準備はいいかいしばしお待ちをこれでよしおやおや鈴代姫そんな血まみれのハンカチを結び直すなんて他に血止めになるものがないのかい手は貸さないけど新しいハンカチくらいはお貸しするよお心遣いありがとうございますでも手当てはこのハンカチで十分ですから<笑>そうかいそれなら結構レッツドイツソザシラでは準備もできたようだしお二方前はいプリンセスワルツリエルタここは鈴代お目覚めかいえー、やお前は最低者うらやましいね特等席だよこんな砂かぶりで姫同士の戦いが見れるなんて I see two people in the arena one of them is without the other 鈴代まさかあの足で決闘をなぜそりゃ彼女が申し込んだからさ何止めなくてはもう止まった見学は許したけど邪魔をするというなら話は別だよプリンセスバルツ検証第9条決闘の最中はいかなる他者も介入することはできないこの舞台は2人のためのもの他の何人たりとも怪我すことはできない Do you know what? Here is a crazy idea. Right now, Iris might say, Lisa, I challenge you. And it will be two against one. Huh? Dakara, ne? Otonash k u m i t o y o u t a r i no a t a k a y o s a White smoke rises up at the night sky. They are the same things that were coming at us when we fought. Let's be frank, they are missiles.、Uh, however, maybe the problem is she would, wouldn't agree to that problem. Then, the cheater. Sushur is the sidesteps the trails of smoke. The missiles disappear in the darkness without even grazing her. But a second later, they return to attack Sushur once more. The cluster of missiles struck Sushiro. She keeps dodging them. But as long as she keeps avoiding the missiles, she can't attack Lizel, who's maintaining her distance. She seems to be trying to find an opportunity to attack, but Lizel realizes this and increases the amount of missiles. Missiles attack Sushiro from four directions. She sidesteps the first, dunks under second, jumps over the third. She leaps at Lizel. But in the middle of her arc, another object appears before her. She wards it off with her parcel, but the blast momentarily blinds her. Lizel uses the time to increase the distance between Sushiro and herself again. Damn, so close. But I'm glad she can move that well. It seems her foot isn't as badly hurt as I thought. So that o k a Iman of Fumikomi, Ipomenikabe, Nihomega Wazaka, Nibukata. 
<laughs> Book Nia, Totemo Banzenia, me and I. Little Oni stays out of Sushiro's way and keeps using ranged attacks. She is using her hammer, which should be her main weapon. She is completely outranging Sushiro. Osorak. Liesel no Nerai wa Jikusen. Sushiro no Ashi ga Hime o Ageru no Matsu ka Mae daro. Huh, that's dirty. Is that her best chance at victory? You know, but as someone who is injured, you could actually use that. Pretend you are injured, then she attacks, and then you go. <sighs> but who am I to talk actually about that? What does he mean? Sushir doesn't seem to be getting a chance to counterattack at all. Her defensive battle has taken her to the edge of the stage. Oh no, she's been cornered. Liesel is like an airborne hunting dog looking down at its prey. Then she flies even higher up into the darkness, probably to deliver the finishing blow. A rain of missiles descends on Sushiro. She has nowhere to go. The next moment, her petite figure is dancing through the air. She was cornered, but she just launched herself off the edge of the stage. She's right, Sushiro can't evade now. She's helpless. The missile strike streak towards her like piranhas at a prey. But a heavy explosion follows, a bright flash illuminates the battlefield. In my mind's eye, I see Sushiro surrounded by a myriad of explosions. However, Suzushi is up, far above the explosion. She's holding her open parcel below herself. That's pretty, pretty neat idea. She's using the explosions beneath to gain speed under the parcel. That's good. That's right, Suzushi used the force of the explosion to slingshot herself up in the air. <laughs> Didn't see that coming, huh? Lizel is so surprised that she can't evade Sushiro. The distance is only one meter now, Sushiro can't miss anymore. What? Ah, she has that bar here. The two figures collide, but it is Sushiro's scream that reaches my ears. She falls to the ground like a bear that got hit by a shotgun. Before she hits the ground, she regains her senses and manages to break her fall. Five black metal orbs are orbiting around Lizel. Their size and color makes them resemble cannonballs. They are what knocked Tsushiro away. Yet another new technique, huh? Just how much stuff does she have packed inside that skirt of hers anyway? Lizel doesn't hesitate for a second. One of the cannonballs orbiting around her suddenly changes its course. The sphere of metal curves at Suzushiro. She jumps back in reflex. Just like before, she is nimbly stepping out of harm's way. Or so it seems. The blast knocks Suzushiro off her feet. The sphere didn't touch her. It exploded out of its own accord. Its destructive power is much greater than the missiles. Suzushiro! Such power. Alma? Out of Alma? I'm pretty sure we had... we have... Uh, butter like that in Poland. <laughs> Not the one I'm using, but whatever. <clears throat> so you say that explosion was made of butter? What? Is it? I don't understand what's Alma actually. 
女の飛行能力や特殊な武器は威力火事によるものだったのか What the hell is that? 威力火事威力を物体に付加しいわゆる威力アイテムを作る技術カジノ国タルミードに受け継がれし技術の一つ OK what the hell is Harma? I need to google this quickly Alma Yes Okay, I have no idea. Never mind. ともその多くは失われた古代の技術。簡単なものなら今でも日用品なども使われてるけど。複雑なものは作るにも操るにも相当な能力が必要となる。にもかかわらずあれほど多彩で大量のアイテムを使いこなしていると。But she's a cheater, so let's draw. The other four spheres peer down on Sushira. Their movement isn't simple tracking. Like the missiles, they seem to purposely change their curves. At first, they circle around Suzushiro in a wide ring, then, they suddenly slant towards her. She launches herself in the air to escape the incoming cannonballs from the front and the sides. Then, the final cannonball sweeps in with a short delay. Suzushiro can't avoid it since she's in the air. She shields herself with her parcel, but it isn't enough to protect, protect her from the blast. The parcel shatters down to the handle. The pieces are blown off the stage. Lizel swings her hammer over her head and swoops towards Sushiro. It's the terrible attack of hers we barely managed to ward off with our sword. And Sushiro is now unarmed. The hammer is already unavoidably close. But then something happens that Chris and I can barely believe. Sushiro sets herself up to take the hammer head on. Suddenly things turn around. Liesel frantically changes direction as if to avoid an impending crisis. But that isn't the end of it. As she evades, a huge missile emerges from her skirt. It continues along the same trajectory that Liesel was on a moment before, bearing down on Suzuhira. <laughs> what the hell was that? I have no idea what just happened. Me too. See this. There was that big missile she fired at point blank range. Just before the missile hit her, Surushiro struck it with her fist. So that means. Yeah, we probably should punch it. So she just blew away the missile, explosion and all with just her fist? The blast only went one way, as if the missile hit an impenetrable wall. Her fist's power greatly exceeded that of the missile. Her bare fist. Oh yeah, but then... When she defeated that gardener, she used the same move. Oh, 
あどけない外見とその体格さえ戻るか格闘拳を用いた超クロスレンジでの一撃それが鈴代の武器なのか But how can she exert that much force with such a small body? 体内に特定の威力を通すことで身体能力を一時的に高める司法の王家にはそういう能力があると聞くが Wait, so is Alma like spiritual energy? それにしてもあれほどまでの威力とは純粋なる拳ふん、うん、彼女はその威力を一切余計なところに回していない拳を放つに必要な筋力そして敵に当たる拳強化しているのはその2点のみ拳を放つことに特化された能力だがその分威力は絶大だその剣圧は爆風さえも吹き飛ばしその拳は瞬間的に鋼鉄の高度を超える If not harder. まさに鉄拳だねけど素晴らしい力だだがその能力にその足は致命的だな<笑>クロスレンジの武器は当てる機動力あって初めて意味をなす Maybe she has actually long range attack with that fist as well その足では今のように誘い込んでのカウンターしか当てる方法はないそれが分かっていれば誘いに乗るものなど今の一撃を決められなかったことが致命傷になる。Lisa rises above the battlefield once again as she speaks. She's at an advantage again. A rain of iron spheres and guided missiles descends from above. It's an incessant barrage of attacks. But none of the projectiles reaches Zushiro before she punches them. Konna mono ikura to bastemo. Watas no hada ni fureru koto sae dekimase. She smiles firstly. Well, these attacks aren't working at all. And she's using projectiles. If this goes on, she'll run out of ammo. That means Zushiro is going to be wearing her out. Pia, so mo ikanai. Why not? すべて打ち落としているのは、そうせざるを得ないからだ。足を止めている時間が徐々に長くなってきている。重たい以上に足の消耗が早い。ああ、なるほど。怪我を負いつつ休む間もない連戦。合わせれば出血量は相当なはず
blood. No good. Damn it, how many of those things does she have? Is she ever going to run out of them? よく持つものだ。痛みで根を上げるためではない。そのAh, oh, well, that's not always true. <laughs> Nicely said. From Lizzo's cloak arrums a barrage of missiles that makes the assault too far look like the occasional drop of rain. All missiles fly into Tsurushiro at once. But Tsurushiro is undaunted. She launches herself off the ground, meeting the storm of projectiles head on. She's planning to attack all the projectiles at once. She starts to spin around her axis. Ow. All the missiles hit at the same time. There is an ear splitting noise. But the line blinds me. A heavy cloud of smoke fills the arena. As I instinctively cover my eyes, I notice there is a person shaped hole in the wall of smoke. Fast. She outrun all the missiles. She outrun our eyes. She outrun Lizzo's calculations. She speeds at Lizzo, even leaving the sound of the explosions behind her. And she turned on the barrier, right? Am I right? Knew it. Shushiro's first blow was stopped short by the shield. That's what she used on us. However, did that shield actually manage to stop everything? Maybe it will break. The shield deforms, it wraps itself around Shushiro's weapon. Shushiro is left hanging helplessly from this thing. Then the missile coming is in from behind slamming to her. <laughs> when again the smoke clears, I see Sushiro lying on the floor like an old rock.俺の拳を信じ、放つ捨て身の一撃。手追いの彼女が時給戦を避けるには、その方法しかなかった。届きこそしなかったけど、第一の姫の教授、見せてもらったよ。涼しろ姫、立ちます。へへへ、でディンセ
because I can sense the epi epic attack right now. <笑>なるほど。まだ悪まで勝利を信じるか。Because What kind of cheating technique is it? Of course, she's launching in the air. Lisa rises up in the air. She looks like she's passing judgment from above. Her words are not a warning, not a threat. She's merely stating the punishment she will give Sudoshiro for standing up. Barfish, safety, Kaijo. Ridok Genka, the countdown. Oh, dead attack again. With two mechanical sound, the hammer begins to change shape. The cylinder splits in two in the middle, revealing that sinister glowing sphere. That's the technique she was going to use on us. The air around it begins to shiver, the glow builds intensity. The surrounding air seems to be drawn into the device and picky being compressed in its center. The air is getting heavy, it's hard to even breathe. なんだそれは。ドバのままさ、質量をコントロールできる仕掛けだよ。あの球体は見かけ通りの重さじゃないって。おそらく遥かに大きなものを威力で圧縮している。遥かに大きなものだと。何によっては山一つ分の質量を閉じ込めるときない。目標、結界の耐久力を超えます。対衝撃準備。最後にもう一度と、降参する気はない。それほど泥
It's as if she's been pinned down by something unseen. She's on all fours, but she can't get up. She can't even lift her head. It's as if her body has been turned to stone. It's too heavy. Lizelle has managed to somehow force herself to her feet and is glaring at Sushiro. Slowly, Sushiro plants her feet a short distance apart and crouches over her. Under the pressure of many times the normal gravity, her wound is gushing out blood. But she doesn't seem to notice. She clenches her fist and sets herself up. It's the same setup she always does, but she draws back further this time. In that instant, she, the stone paving cracks in a circle around her. Her alma is dramatically rising. I can feel it even from here. This is it. She's going to use her iron fist. And this is the best she has. The fist of justice. Suzushiro's weapon. She needs mobility to make it connect. But there is another way. Iron fist, iron fist. I think I know where I know the term, the iron fist. <laughs> I won't tell. And that is taking away her enemy's mobility. Her yield of gravity is meant to prevent her enemy from avoiding her attack. She has ensured a dark hit. What's more, she has ensured a fatal blow. <laughs> Lisa lets out a hole. Her dress changes shape and turns into her shield. However, her roar is drowned out by an even greater one. Whoa, what's with the tattoo? I think it wasn't there before. The stage is swallowed by the torrent of light. The stone, the earth is engulfed in the raging gale of power. Only the wall of iron stands in its path. It's holding a search at bay. But that lasts no longer than a moment. Something is ejected from the circle. It looks like a person. It flies through the air, then slumps into the bell tower. At last, the maelstrom of light abates. From the direction of the bell tower comes the sound of falling stone. None of us speaks a word. Lizelle is lying on the floor. She doesn't seem to be about to get up. Surshiro is still in her attack pose, her fist outstretched. The battlefield is silent for the first time since the duel will begin. <sighs> I 
Is it older? If you ask that question, it might not be over, actually. Ah, I know, I knew it. One of Lizzo's finger spasms. Following that tiny movement, the rest of her body gets its strength back. Supporting herself on her broken hammer and with trembling limbs, she gets back to her feet. Whoa, looking good. Her legs are completely exposed. The fabric of her dress has been all but completely destroyed. The devices it was hiding are plainly visible now. I knew it. The jet strapped around her waist emit smoke and sputter on it off. She took that hit and stood back up. Had Lizel's feet lie many small fragments of her shield. That same shield could easily stop our sword. I know its defensive value. And that makes me realize just how powerful Tsurushiro's attack was. <laughs> こりっ her jets ignite. The flames are shaky, they seem likely to snuff out any moment, like their master. The jets master the last of their strength. Lizel unsteadily steps forward, bringing her iron hammer to bear. She's going for the final showdown. Sushiro crouches over again and heaves a sigh. For the second time, the floor around her begins to crack. Her legs disappear into the floor. Once again, the gravitational field saves us little. She starts sinking into the ground. Lizel's knees buckle, but with a fierce yell, she makes them straighten. At the same time, there's a noise from her jets. Great tongues of flame shoot forth, as if the jets are burning up Lizel's own life force. Now I feel bad for her, you know? For black smoke is starting to pour from the jets. Lisa slowly rises off the ground. She is flying, holding her partially destroyed hammer. There is a glint in the darkness. She is launching an attack with the very last of her strength. However, Sushiro's gravitational field is holding steady. Lizzo's ascent stops. She starts falling back towards the floor. But for she's falling, her attack doesn't stop. Fo, she scrapes along the floor, causing dust to fly up. Lizzo continues her charge. Whereas Lisa looks like she's betting her very life on this, Sushiro appears calm. She does seem to hold any content, contempt for her food. She faces her enemy's final gambit. 
The time for words is over. All that is left is to respond with her fist. They meet. They part. And then silence. あなたの思い。しかと受け止めました。この一撃。大槌の壊れる前に放っていれば、あるいは結果は逆になっていたかもしれません。Lizard's forehead appears to be sparkling. The fragments of her tiara, smashed by Suzushiro's fist, dance in the moonlight. Gently, the black clad figure topples forward. When she hits the floor, her dress cries out in agony. The sound is like a death wail, it echoes through across the stage. <sighs> if not for the Jitsi tactics, I would love Lisa for sure. The bell towers toll at the same time the referees make their statements. Zushiro closes her eyes and sinks to her knees. I hurry over to Zushiro, but before I reach her, there is a sudden bright light. <gasps> the source is a pillar of light rising out of the floor. A human figure slowly floats up inside that pillar of light. Diesel. <laughs> そんな怖い顔しないで。歯医者に恥ずかしめを与えるほど趣味は悪くないよ。歯医者は舞台を降りる。ただそれだけのことさ。At the top of the pillar of light, I can see a large gate. The gate opens. The pillar of light extends itself through the doors. Slowly, Lisa rises in the light. She's already out of reach. She's rising to the heavens. To the gate. I can only watch her ascend. Okay. I turn around. Suzuro is already back on her feet, watching me. Suzuro, did you see me? Ah, Shikato, with this eye. Actually, four eyes! Well, that would make six, actually. Yeah. 
。どういう意味ですか君はすでに君の意思を見せた。次は私がそれに答える番だ。<笑>剣の姫イーリスが申し込む。大地の姫鈴代。私はお前との決闘を望む。喜んで。ジュリ、記録。<笑>では、涼しろ姫。決闘の日時をどうぞ。プリンセスワルツ検証、第7条。決闘の日時は、申し込まれた者が指定する。We know about that. 有効期間は、申し込まれた瞬間から、2日後の24時まで。ちなみに今の時刻はと、いや、0時3分。ちょうど日付が変わったところだね。<笑>一番早くなら今すぐ。一番遅くなら71時間と57分後だ。さあ、どうする<笑>今すぐにでも、と言いたいところですが、せっかくのワルツを、このような召し物で踊るは無粋というもの。Yeah, that's the reason for sure. 2日後、時刻は21時。互いに、悔いの残らぬ体でし合うといたしましょう。<笑>了解した。それでは、本日のワルツ。Yeah. And I guess for this episode, the current science falls. So, yeah, hope you enjoyed it, and see you in the next one. Bye bye.